himself. But a reversal, nice job by Rivera there. He gets the two. That's not what Matt wanted to happen right there. And now Sebastian Rivera coming in. He was behind going into the second period last year in the finals against RBY from uh, Penn State. And the ride he put on in that second period really was what turned the tide. Just really tough. Look at that pressure right there. The wrist that he's found. He just really got Matten extended. Tim, was it a case that Matten gambled a little bit too much there and he paid for it? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, and he was thinking that, Ray. That's a good uh, call right there because he absolutely just wanted to give one, not two. And, it, and it, he just stayed on just a little bit too um, uh, long, a second too long, and gave up the two. Uh, very frustrating for him, I'm sure, because it was never the plan, obviously. He, he had a plan. I'm going to ride as long as I can. Well, now Rivera, there is a scramble as they are going out of bounds with 51 seconds to go here in the second period. But the riding time is nearly 40 seconds for Sebastian Rivera, so something to be cognizant of for the Brad now with Rutgers in Sebastian Rivera, the former Northwestern product with 73 career wins as a Wildcat. That was really close to a reversal for Matten, but they called no change because of going out of bounds. And so good action there by Matten against a very, very tough Sebastian Rivera, who was the uh, most outstanding wrestler of the Big Ten Championships last year. Two-time Big Ten champion, you got to remember, 125, 133, now up to 141. Shades of Kyle Dake. Boom, boom, boom. Sebastian, not often done. No, not at all. And his father, Sebastian Rivera's father, actually runs Elite Wrestling there in New Jersey for more than 25 years, wanted to be closer to home. And lo and behold, he is now having his way against Drew Matten here at the rack. Yes, Dad Steve was a Division Three national champion at the College of New Jersey. And, and, uh, certainly has had a lot to do with the success of Seb. And the riding time is over a minute now, a minute 20 for Sebastian Rivera. Very good control there for Rivera. It's like having a straight jacket on you, Tim. Yeah, the mistake by Matten here. He got a little high and then down on his hips and the turn in. And at two points, and then Jill Matt. Matten comes right back here, keeps his head up, and then on the turn, man, those hips turn just almost in time to get the two, but they went out of bounds. Third and final period between Sebastian Rivera and Drew Matten. Matten continues to have his issues as Rivera increases his riding time. Yeah, his issue is uh, how good Sebastian Rivera is on top. He's as good as they come across the nation there because he's always moving forward. He's extending his uh, opponent here. Matten just can't get his belly off the mat, the wrist, and, and, and then he's driving forward. Right now, looking to try to work that tilt if he can, but... And let's not forget, Tim, as we are have a minute 20 to go in the third period, Rutgers is down 9-0 in the first two matches, so I think it is cognizant for Rivera to try to keep scoring. And here's the score that you're talking about. He's getting the score now, and if he gets the count there, he's got four right there. That four-point near fall, game-changer. Man, I'll tell you what, that's the difference sometimes between the major uh, or the tech fall and before when it was only two and three point near falls and right there all of a sudden boom with riding time you got a major and what you were talking about ray now if it stays this way it's nine to four not nine to three and so that's a big point that sebastian's working on especially as rutgers is trying to make this a closer matchup every point so pivotal and sebastian rivera being i would say the leader of this team is trying to really make a statement he got caught down below the waist. You can't stay down there. The five count. There's a warning on Sebastian for warrant uh, for uh, stalling when you ride for uh, five seconds below uh, the waist there. But he was not going to give up the the uh, escape, and he'll gladly give up the warning. If you're Sebastian Rivera, Tim, how important is it for you just to try to ride out Drew Matten to make sure that you get that major decision, which stands for four points? Well, now you're you're, you're right on. I mean, it's third period. Um, you've worked really hard. You got that four-point near fall. Now you just stay, continue to drive, 
but you, you uh, can't give up the escape because this is a big point. And Sebastian, uh, as you talked about, is a team leader. He wants to uh, lead the team. And the best way to do it is to win and get extra points for your team in the dual meet. We are approaching the final 10 seconds. Sebastian Rivera in control against Drew Madden. Madden trying to get to his feet, but Rivera continues to dominate him. Kind of uh, showed you what I was talking about. What